Hello guys, how's everybody doing? I hope you're all doing great. You're watching Minecraft Sekai and welcome on back to another tutorial where I'm going to be showing you how to build this Asian style fountain. So as you can see, we've got the Asian inspired roof right here with the flares and I guess the overall shape of the fountain seems to indicate that it's really Asian inspired. And uh, I did a tutorial a while ago on how to build a fountain, so make sure to check that one out if you want more fountain tutorials. And yeah, if you now if you're wondering about these leaves right here, we've got these cherry blossom trees or sakura trees, whatever. Uh, so yeah, if you're wondering about these leaves, uh, I've got an add-on called Germs Better Leaves add-on, and yeah, these. These are the, I guess, birch leaves. Yeah, these are the birch leaves. They're not always uh, pink. They're actually only uh, pink in the uh, mountain biome and uh, orange in the plains biome and yellow in every other biome. I just uh, make it so that it's always pink just for the purpose of, these, of this video. And so, yeah, if you're wondering about these leaves, uh, I'm going to put the the add-on the link to the add-on in, in the description if you want to download it but anyways now let's uh take a little spin around around this fountain with a little time lapse elapse and then we could hop on straight into the tutorial as we always do So these are the materials that we're going to be using throughout this build and we're going to start off by grabbing some stone and we're going to make uh, an 11 by 11 box right here. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, twist right here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 11 here and another 11 blocks right here on this side. Now we're going to place one, two blocks like this, two on this side and two on this side. Now let's repeat this process in each corner. So we've got one, two here, two and another two like this. Now let's do the same thing down here. So we've got one, two here, two on this side and two on this other side. Same thing on each corner again. So one, two, one, two, one, two. Now, let's place one, two, three blocks on this corner, like this, and same thing again on each corner. So, one, two, three, like that. One, two, three. One, two, and three. Now, let's grab some slabs, stone slabs, and we're going to place one here, and another one like this, and another two like right on this side, like that. Same thing again on each corner. So we've got one, two like this, two, two here, two, two, and two like that. Now we're gonna do the same thing for this, uh, these blocks right here, down here. So we've got one, two like that, one, two, one, two, one, two, and yeah, same thing on each corner. All right, now let's place a slab up here, and another one right here, and another one right down here. So, one, two, three slabs like that on each corner again. So, one, two, three, and one, two, and three. All right, now we're gonna replace these grass blocks right here with stones like this there we go next let's get some uh, stairs first some stone stairs and then we're gonna get some stone blocks we're gonna place a block on each corner like this and then a slab on top 
just like so and then get your stone stairs and place them like this and there we go now let's get some trap doors some spruce trap doors I'm gonna place a trap door on front of these stairs like this all around And then trap doors right here as well, like this, and all the sides like this. And there we go. Now, let's get the stone blocks again. We're going to place one, two, three blocks on this corner, three on this corner. And three on each corner now let's get some stairs we're gonna place one two three four five like this five on this side and five on each side just like so then we're gonna put upside down stairs on top of these stairs that we just placed just like this Now let's place stairs again on top of these upside down stairs, like this, and then we're going to grab the stones and we're going to seal this off just like so. Then we're going to make uh, a wall right here raised by one, two, three and four just like this then another one wall right here and yeah let's surround this area with a full uh, four blocks uh, tall wall just like this there we go now let's grab the stone stairs again, we're gonna break two blocks like that and place a stair here and an upside down stair right above it. Same thing again on each side. There we go. Now let's place a stair here and a stair right there, then a slab right here in the corner. Same thing again on each corner, so we've got two stairs like that, and a slab right there. There we go, now let's place a slab here, slab here, here, and right here as well. Alright, now let's place a block right here in the corner. And another one above it just like so then same thing on each corner so we've got two blocks floating like this in the corner let's do it again right here and the last one right there now let's get some stone stairs we're gonna place one two stairs like that then a full block then another stair full block and then two other stairs like that same thing again on each side so we've got one two stairs full block stair full block and two other stairs there we go all right now we're gonna get some uh, full blocks. We're gonna place a full block right there, full block here, here, and right there on that corner as well. Let's get some stone slabs. We're gonna place a slab here, slab here, and two other slabs right down there. Same thing again on each corner. So we've got four slabs like that, four, and four right there. Okay. 
Now, let's get the stone blocks again, and then we're gonna raise a pillar here by one, two, three, four, five, six. And then, same thing on each corner again. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Then, we're gonna get some stone stairs. Place a stair here, stair here. Same thing again on each side. This is a very symmetrical build right here. So, I've got all the way, uh, all similar in all, on all the sides. So, so next, we're gonna uh, skip one, two blocks two blocks on top of this stair and then place an upside down like that on the third block so one two on the third block place an upside down stair same thing again on each side so one two stair one two stair upside down and yeah all the way around then we're gonna place uh, regular placed stairs on top of these upside downs just like this There we go. Now let's grab some trap doors. We're gonna place a trap door here, here, and on, on all the sides again. And then two here, and one, two, three up here. Same thing again. So one, two trap doors, and three up here. One, two, and three. Trap doors right there, and right here as well. There we go. Now I think it's time to work on the roof. So uh, we're gonna get some dark oak for that. We've got some dark oak planks, dark oak stairs, slabs, and also trap doors. So let's get some walls and fences as well. And yeah. We're gonna start by grabbing the dark oak slabs. We're gonna place a slab right here in the middle. One, two right there. One, two. And then two full blocks on this side. And another two full blocks on this side. Just like so. Then same thing again on each side. So one, one, two, one, two, one, two full blocks like that. And two other full blocks here. And again, we're going to repeat the same process. There we go. Now, next, we're going to grab some slabs. And then we're going to place a slab on top of this full block. Two slabs like that. And then another slab above like this. Let's repeat the same thing. So a slab here, two on the sides, and another one at the same level as this one. Just like so. There we go. Now let's grab the dark oak trap doors. We're gonna place Trap doors on top of these two slabs and another one underneath this slab like that. Then we're gonna place a trap door underneath this full block here and another one right there. And same thing again on each corner. So one, two, three, four, five trap doors like that. There we go. Now let's grab some dark oak planks and we're gonna place them in the corners right here. Just like so. And then, oops. We're gonna place full blocks right here. Like that. On the corners, two full blocks. And then stairs in these remaining gaps. Just like so. Then we're gonna place stairs on top of these full blocks, like this, on each side. And then trap doors, dark oak trap doors on top right here. There 
we go. Then we're gonna place um, full blocks, I guess, in here, in the, in the corners, and then upside down stairs, and these remaining gaps, like that. And then we're gonna place regular placed stairs on top of these upside downs, like that, and then a full block right there with a slab on top. And then trapdoors, dark oak trapdoors in these corners. And there we go. Now, let's get down here. We're gonna place trapdoors in these uh, gaps here to cover these gaps. We're gonna place a full block here and slabs in the corners forgot this one then we're gonna place a wall right there with a fence I guess on oh, no without that without a fence now let's get a, a full block of our stone and then cover this up then we're gonna place a full block here and slabs right here on the sides then a wall on top all right, now let's grab some water and let's put some water on this thing. And uh, this part is a little bit tricky, so make sure to pay attention to this. And I uh, I would assume that this would be a bit different in Bidrock Edition. I've never played Bidrock Edition, so yeah. If anyone out there that knows how to fix any issues, if if there will be any issues with this water placement. Please comment that below so I can pin it for all uh, of other the other Bedrock Edition uh, players that who will watch this video. So yeah, let's do that now and please pay, pay attention to this because it's a bit tricky. So we're gonna start off by waterlogging these stairs like that. Then we're gonna waterlog one trapdoor right here, and then waterlog these stairs both like that. And same thing, we're gonna do the same thing again on each side. So we've got, we're gonna waterlog these stairs, one of the trap doors, and both of these uh, stairs on the sides. Same thing again on this side. Right now, next thing to do is we're gonna place water on top of this slab right here. So place it like that, and same thing again in each corner. All right. Now we're gonna come right on top right here, and then we're gonna place water right here on these gaps, and then we're gonna waterlog these trap doors. And then we're gonna place uh, a water bucket on top of this wall, just like so. And I believe that's all there is to it. Now, let's add some lights, some hanging uh, lanterns from these fences. Oh, I forgot to put the fences, so I forgot this. You're gonna get your stone bricks and the fences. So we're gonna place... Uh, a stone a brick like that another one here same thing on each corner just like so two there two and then we're gonna grab uh, the spruce fences place them on top like that and then we're gonna grab uh, the stone brick walls again and we're gonna place them right there on the corners and then fences spruce fences hanging down again just like that now let's grab the lights and we're gonna place light right there one there 
same thing again on each side just like so we're gonna hang down some lights from these fences and then lights on top on these corners one more light right here and we should be all set now the only thing that you need to add to this um, uh, fountain is the texturing so yeah just texture this with your uh, the usual palette as you see here we've got stone bricks regular stone andesite and cobblestone and yeah you should be all set for this um, fountain design and that is the tutorial i hope you guys liked today's build and don't forget to drop a like on this video it, it really really helps the video a lot as well as commenting so yeah that would be very much appreciated and if you like these tutorials and time lapses that i'm uploading please subscribe and hit that bell we are at nine subscribers now we were getting close to 10k all because of your support guys so thank you so much for that and yeah that's it see you all on another video